Hello everybody, welcome back to the McNutter Butters. I am Caitlin McNutt and today I wanted to do something a little fun. I wanted to take you guys along with me for my grocery shopping and uh, do like a grocery haul kind of thing. I am going to Walmart and Aldi and I don't know how it's going to go bringing, a, bringing my phone out and just like filming in the grocery stores. I don't know how that's going to go but we're gonna do it. So I'm gonna show you guys kind of how I go about making my list. But first, ah, <laughs> look at that. <laughs> I love this sweater. I bought it last year and I was a little worried about washing it because I thought, oh, it's not gonna light back up after I wash it. No, nope, it still lights up after being washed. And I'm like, okay. And then, yeah. Here's Alyssa McNutt. You want to show them your shirt, your Christmas shirt? It says, Peace, Love, Santa. Hey, guys. Yeah. Oh, and there's Tata's shirt. I like it. It does, but I am that. His Christmas llama. Lele, you stand up. Show them your outfit, baby. Huh? Come on, stand up. Stand up, baby. You want to show them your t-shirt? Maybe. Maybe she'll let me show it off later. Oh, wait, 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 we're getting up, we're getting up. Okay, we gotta put the blankie down. All right, let's see here. So we got the reindeer and a little tutu and the cute little leggings. Yeah, get that thumb out that mouth. That's good. Okay, <clears throat> so we are filling the Christmas clothing today. But all right, let me get turned or, the camera turned around here so I can show y'all what I do on my list. Okay, I usually shop like a week at a time, but I don't know. I can't think much past Sunday. And keep in mind, we have stuff in our fridge, freezer, um, storage cabinet, not storage cabinet, like reserve, I guess, food pantry or whatever. Um, so if we can't get out for whatever reason, like we have other stuff. It's just I like, you know. To plan for each week, even if we do have extra stuff. So, can I give Daisy a piece of turkey? Yes. Um, I can't think much past Monday, Sunday. I don't know why. I just can't. But today is Wednesday, and I I do have stuff we could have for supper tonight. But it's like the stuff that is in case bad things happen. So, like we get snowed in or. I don't know. They shut down the stores. I have no idea. Anyway, or the short the stores have bare shelves again. But anyway, so for tonight, I want to do just some simple pizza and breadsticks. Tomorrow, I'm wanting to do a pasta Alfredo with some of our deer sausage. Friday, a crock pot of potatoes and like the kielbasa sausage and carrots. Saturday, we're going to Zoo Tastic, which is like kind of like a little private zoo, but mostly we're going for the lights and to have a picture made with Santa. And then Sunday, we'll do an Italian sausage white bean soup. And I'm just realizing I've got a lot of sausage <laughs> planned for this week. What is all this? Well, hold on, Alyssa. So this is deer sausage. This is kielbasa. And this is Italian sausage. Well, at least they're flavored different. Whatever. Anyway. And then for breakfast, I'm like, okay, biscuits, eggs, sausage, bacon, cereal, lunch, make sure the kids got their chicken nuggets. I like soup, and sometimes the kids like the oodles and noodles. And then snacks, some cookies, fruit, chips, popcorn, some macaroons. I know it sounds weird, but Aldi has got these macaroons in the their macaroons. in their frozen section that are that are really good. But all right, so then as I write that out I flip it over I'm gonna go to Aldi I'm gonna go to Walmart and then I've got other cuz I'm not entirely sure where I want to get some other things all right so we have pizza breadsticks kielbasa potatoes onion pasta alfredo sauce white beans bacon chicken broth biscuits milk chicken nuggets crackers chicken soup cookies fruit chips macaroons Sweet biscuits. I know that sounds weird. Sounds really weird, but they carry like the Bojangles Bowberry biscuits at Walmart, and I can. They're not actually like Bowberry, but they're blueberry biscuits, and the kids like them. So sweet biscuits. 
noodles, popcorn, coffee creamer, and eggnog. Because this time of year, my husband will not live without it. We've got to exchange a pair of jeans that Alyssa got. We accidentally got the wrong size. Cotton balls, Q-tips, dog food, and doggy treats. Because can't let the doggy woggy starve. And I was really trying hard to do like keto and everything. Thanksgiving ruined it. Like it absolutely ruined it. And I could have just jumped back on it. But my husband made a very good valid point. He's like, Christmas is coming. We're going to have parties. We're going to have things to go to. And he's like, are you really, really going to not drink a cup of hot cocoa or turn away the pumpkin pie? And I'm like, mm, I don't want to. So, yeah. It's, it is, my keto is postponed until after Christmas. And, which is so funny and sad in a way. Because I had lost 15 pounds, was feeling so good about myself. And then I weighed myself last night when my husband was weighing all these meats and stuff. And I'm like, how much do I weigh? Yeah. It's all back. All back. But, oh well, what are you going to do? I'll pick it back up in January when everybody else is dieting as well. is just covered hmm okay so well, I guess we'll start over here so we have our <laughs> back dog foods upside down whoops but this is the dog food Purina dog chow that we usually get Daisy um, it's like $12 and here lately I guess because we've been giving her scraps and stuff she's not been half eating it so I also grabbed some of these, and I think I might mix like half a pouch or so in with her regular dog food just to see if she will eat it. Now, do not judge me on the amount of snacks we have. I know it's ridiculous, but we have apples, ice cream sandwiches, these macaroons. I'm telling y'all, I'm telling y'all, these things are heavenly. I got two boxes. Two. They're like $5 a box. I don't even care. They're so good. Some Oreos, chocolate chip cookies, some uh, popcorn. Now this, mmm, yeah, look at it in the bag. Um, we don't, on Wednesdays, 
um, in our area, Mennonites set up a food truck. And, mm, 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 mm. let me show y'all what is in this bag. They taste delicious. I just have Look at that big old donut. Look at it. I wish you could smell it. Whoop, dropping stuff. It smells mm, as good as it tastes. And it's still warm. Ah! Yep. I got um, six of them for $15. And I know that's a little pricey, but it is what it is. All right, also for Daisy, I got her her um, peanut butter doggy biscuits because she likes them. And, uh, well, honey, if you can't find your cup, get another cup. Uh, we got some noodles of noodles, some cup of noodles, two boxes of the dinosaur nuggets because my kids will start up, go through a box and a half in a week. All right, we got... Chocolate biscuits, a couple things of blueberry biscuits, a couple of the jumbo flaky biscuits. Yeah, we like biscuits. I got some more pumpkin pie spice creamer, three cans of white beans. I got some cans of chicken noodle, like regular chicken noodle soup, and then one can of chunky chicken noodle. I got some pesto kids quit messing please go watch your tv show i got some bacon two things of kielbasa okay we'll go sit it down somewhere um yeah go get your paper you had it in and go sit it down look at that face look at that face well then go get a paper towel was it good at least yeah i don't i can't reason oh my goodness Okay, we had a lot of distractions there. Okay, got everything handled. And now there's some potatoes. I don't know if I actually said we got some sliced cheese. That wasn't on the list, but we needed some sliced cheese. And some chicken broth. And then for supper tonight, just a quick easy pizza and some breadsticks. These things are really good. Um, I only needed one jar of Alfredo and one box of these noodles but ever since we saw like shelves going bare at the beginning of this year whenever we have something that we know we can put back in our um like extra food cabinet I'll just grab an extra can or extra jar and extra box of noodles or like an extra can or two of something you know it doesn't break the bank but you know it adds up over time I'll have to show y'all our extra food cabinet sometime and over here is more snacks we have white cheddar cheese popcorn nacho chips uh sour cream and onion chips ranch flavored chips here's Alyssa's jeans that she exchanged for the right size some saltine crackers a gallon and half a gallon of milk because yeah our family of five straight up goes through a gallon and a half of milk a week <laughs> Um, my husband drinks a glass of milk every night before bed. The kids love cereal, so, yeah, it, it gets gone. And then, instead of getting cotton balls, I got these cotton rounds, these little things, um, because I use it for putting my toner on my face, so this works out really good. I think that'll work great. And got some Q-tips, so... That is our grocery haul. Lots and lots of stuff. Who wants to come by and help me put it all away? Yeah, who wants to help me put it away? Mm. Okay. Um, so the only thing I did not get on my list was the eggnog. Because um, I was like, oh, we don't need to get it at Walmart. I'll get it at Aldi. And then I didn't see any at Aldi. Sorry to my husband. Maybe the Mennonite Donuts will make up for it. Um, so yeah, we I make a list just in hopes of not forgetting certain things that I know I'm going to need. But if I add extra to it, it's okay. Because obviously, there's a whole lot more on here that was than what was on my list. But it's okay. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this little... Uh, shop with me, grocery haul, whatever you want to call it. And um, if you did, please hit that like button. And if you haven't already, please subscribe. It's free to you. That helps me. 
All right, guys, I'll see you next time. Bye.